Welcome back to Good Day Atlanta. Does your kid love video games? Heck, do you love video games? Well, the Fox 5 I team's Dana Fowl says you can earn a very good living in the gaming business. And Dana, there are plenty of opportunities out there, correct? Oh, absolutely. When I say good living, I'm not fooling around here. You know, the World Congress Center this weekend will be wide open for so many job opportunities at this year's MomoCon convention. But let me get to some of these numbers first that Ron was talking about. The gaming industry employs in Georgia more than 3,200 people and their average compensation in 2015 was $96,000 a year. Yeah, it includes salary and insurance and things like that, but I gotta tell you folks, that is nothing to sniff at. And statewide, we have 13 college programs dedicated to the gaming industry. This is our control room. They're monitoring a live game right now. Let's peek inside a gaming shop. This is High res Studios in Alpharetta, and they employ more than 400 people, most of them under the age of 30. And that's it for update 5.9, Dragon's Fortune. It looks like fun, and it is, but these folks are working. It's a high-tech facility where you can be a programmer, producer, project manager, customer support. There's also character, concepts, and animator designers. They have software builders, artists, marketers. I could go on and on. We've got a ton of stuff to go over. But I'm going to let Isaiah Turner tell you more. He's a community producer for a game called Smite. He chats with gamers and takes their feedback to the bosses. And this is his dream job. I was always a gamer, a gamer by heart. Uh, I've been in love with video games since I was a little kid. Uh, so it was always my dream to kind of to kind of get a job in the video game industry and work with the games that I play on a daily basis. Sound good? <laughs> Then head on over to the World Congress Center this weekend for MomoCon. Steelers that way! It runs through Sunday. It's a visual explosion of anime, animation, gaming, and comics. It's for fans. <laughs> And it's for folks looking to work in the field. And Scarlett Dangerfield, yes, that's the coolest name ever. Well, her team at High res Studios will also be there. If you'll be job hunting, here are her tips. Just do some research on the different companies that will be there. I believe they should be on the MomoCon website. It's always good to know a little bit about the different employers and kind of why you're interested in them. Um, check out our games if you have some time. Um, and if you want to come meet with us, always bring your resume and portfolio if you have one. Whether you're here for fun this is the kind of work I'm interested in. or to find a job, the owner of MomoCon says just come on down and be the best geek you can be. His words, not mine. Geek is a perfectly okay term. I mean, nerd might have a little more uh, derogatory connotations, but I mean, even nerd's fine. I would like to wear one of those wigs. I'm just saying, that's my, I don't know, I would. But MomoCon, what, what does that even mean? That was my question. I thought, what is that? Well, Momo means peach in Japanese, we're told. And since this all got started with the Georgia Tech Anime Club, and anime is all about Japanese animation, and this gathering got started in the peach state, they landed on MomoCon. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, my son loves esports, and they're paying these players to form teams and play in tournaments. It's awesome. I just earn money. learned what that was recently. I didn't yeah. know what eSports was, but that's fascinating. Yeah. yeah, and it all started yesterday. Yeah, Cole. absolutely. It's a four-day event, mm -hmm. so you got plenty of time to get down there. Yeah, you can take the kids. It's all ages. It runs through 7 to night. Saturday, it's 10 to 7, and Sunday, 10 to 5. Yeah, you can tell they're really into it. Go out there and maybe see if you can get a job with them. Wear a costume. <laughs> Anytime you get to wear a costume, throw on a hot pink wig, yep. I say go. All right, Dana, thank you very much. <laughs> Seven